Magnificent Flaming Gorge is one of this country's most scenic fishing destinations. It's located in northeast Utah, spanning the Utah-Wyoming border. The reservoir is 91 miles long, and the Utah portion is unquestionably the most scenic, surrounded by juniper forests and colorful sandstone cliffs. Today, my friend Roger and I had the opportunity to fish the Sheep Creek portion of the reservoir. Right off the bat, we were into a good school of small pup lake trout. I put two on the ice before I could get a camera set up. Dang! He got messed up in the transducer cord. Lake trout that are under 10 pounds at Flaming Gorge are considered to be pups, which is what I was catching today. We had found these pups in about 65 feet of water off a steep rocky shoreline point. There's another one. Get that cord out of the way this time. That one's about 13 inches. Lake trout are overpopulated in the gorge, and so the DWR has set a limit of 12 lakers, allowing only one over 28 inches to help thin the numbers. These small pups are really good eating, too. As the sun came over the horizon, we beheld the reason Flaming Gorge got its name. Man, there isn't any prettier place to ice fish. It's great to spend the day fishing in some of God's most beautiful country. Ah, missed one. And another one, little buggers. There we go. Get the transducer out of the way, I don't want to lose another fish. They're getting smaller. I switched over to a spoon and got another one. Hey, that one's pushing 15 inches. The best lures today were Rapala jigging wraps, flutter spoons, and 4 inch white tube jigs, all tipped with some type of fish meat. Sucker, chub, or carp are popular options. Well, while I was catching pup lakers, my friend Roger was back behind me getting serious with a real one. Whoa, hey, that's a nice fish. How 
Oh, hey, hey, I think I got a fish too. Wait. Oh, well, my second rod. Hey, your dang fish just wrapped up all my lines, bro. With my hook stuck on Roger's line, I actually ended up pulling my hooks out of his hole to clear my lines while he fought his giant. Wow. This is a huge fish, and Roger only has six pound <laughs> leader attached to heavier braided line. Play him careful. <laughs> I can feel you pumping him now. Oh, if it comes up, that'd be nice if it'd come up and I'd just... You know what, if you, yeah, you can maybe set your, if it comes up here again, you set your rod down, you might be able to hook the jig with the... Scoop? Here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Roger. <laughs> This is backwards. Um, it should have been me catching the little guys and, uh, <laughs> and uh, you hooking on to this guy. I think I saw him. I better put my glasses on. The last thing I want is for the hook to come free at the last minute and stick me in the eye. Listen to that drag saying. Oh, hey, here he is. Get his head coming up the hole. I got him. Way to be, Roger. That thing is huge. Roger is a former Flaming Gorge biologist, so he's handled a lot of trophy Lakers in his day. So he has a pretty educated guess at how big this guy is. At 36 inches long, he was estimated to be right around 20 pounds. No better way to end our day with a trophy lake trout at one of the most beautiful places on earth. <laughs> wow! <laughs>